Your place, your money. Brought to you by Rogue Credit Union and AARP. Welcome to Your Place, Your Money. Joined today by Rogue Credit Union President and CEO Gene Pelham. Gene, thanks for taking the time. Uh, nice to join you virtually today. Absolutely. It's good to see you again. So we're, I want to talk today about renter's insurance. It's certainly something that's on a lot of people's minds. Uh, what, what do people need to know about renter's insurance? Well, you know, I have been involved in a lot of the wildfire uh, meetings and, uh, you know, working on recovery. And I think that's one of the biggest questions right now is that uh, folks thought they were covered and realized, unfortunately, they weren't covered. And so uh, the most important thing about renter's insurance is, is understanding and separating the facts from the myths. The, the myths are that you're covered uh, if you live in an apartment by the owner and, and you're not. Your personal possessions are not covered. Uh, some of the other myths are that uh, it's too expensive. If you really look at the cost for renter's insurance, uh, it's, it's, you know, a lunch. Uh, a couple of coffees a month and you could cover renter's insurance. And if you think about what it would cost just to replace your wardrobe if it was lost in a fire, uh, let alone um, other items, I, I, there are a lot of tools out there to help folks with um, understanding the need for renter's insurance and where you can actually do an inventory and in the values. And I just did the electronic se section and that comes to over $4,000. And even if you had half of that, how many people have two thousand dollars in their their account just to to recover from that so i think one of the important things about renter's insurance is that you really need to understand what it covers it's more than just uh recovering that old furniture that your grandmother gave you um it really is your laptop the new ps5 that you're still paying for on your credit card all of those things would be covered with renter's insurance and so please understand what the loss would be for yourself what your rights are and uh, go out and, and do some investigation before you say no. Some great advice, Gene. Thanks so much for taking the time. You bet.